So hi everyone welcome back to Thermatography and today I'm going to talk about some Photoshop tutorial and manipulation and I'm going to show you how I did the basic manipulation photography. So and for this purpose you need to have some basic knowledge of Photoshop and about editing skills. I will show you how I did this uh, manipulation and show you a very rough breakdown. I'm not going to do this uh, editing from beginning because it will be very time consuming. So I'm going to quickly do a breakdown but if you have a basic idea about Photoshop you can do this. And I will also provide you this stock image, actually it is my own image, this dear picture and this galaxy. Uh, I basically edited my own uh, clicked picture so it is uh, kind of fun for me and let's begin this video. So guys let's uh, start this video and you can see this is the original picture, this is the picture of the deer which I clicked at uh, Bordia Nessa Park and I need to separate the foreground and background for this you need to go to this brush tool and you can see quick selection tool or you can also play with this magnetic lasso tool and uh, simply zoom in and then you need to give a very time you need to keep much more time to do a very fine selection like this i have already done this selection so uh, this is how my selection looks like so you can see i have already selected and i have already done the color correction of the deer for the color correction you need to go to this filter camera raw filter and then you need to play with this contrast i have already done this play with some clarity and add some dignity in the deer and this is the color correction picture and also you can see let me remove this selection wait so this select and then you will add this milky way galaxy at background and you can see i have add some layer mask you go to this section and then after clicking this you will see this layer mask it is white and then I will use a brush tool opacity of 33 to simply mask the foreground and background so I will do a very fine refining I have actually already done it so I'm just going to do a rough editing and it should be black and then I will add some photo filter make it bluish you can find this photo filter here and then you add a cooling filter i have already added so i'm going to delete this and then you need to add a color lookup like this and go to color lookup and change this photo from night from day or moonlight and this will look like a night picture and then you play with the opacity here so this is the original and then you simply play with the opacity in order to make it look like a night vibe. So let's delete this and then I'm going to add the moon behind the deer. So you need to put this moon layer behind the layer below the layer from the deer and you can see there is kind of glow effects. For that you need to go to this FX section and play with this outer glow look at this and at outer glow the blend mode is a screen and then you play with the opacity and you will simply see which one looks better and then you play with the size and this is the outer glow and then you go to this inner glow and look at this here also you play with the opacity and make it glow and also the size and this is how it looks like so with this effect and then I will make this moon and this galaxy a little bit purple in order to match the uh, color of the deer skin so and then I will add some light here you can see this is actually a normal light I will provide this light link 
and then you would change the blending mode to a screen and then you add a layer mask you can see I have play with the brush tool and you simply remove the unwanted part where you don't want this light and here you can see there will be a light uh, let me show you like this look this will look like this and then you add this is this particle layer look and here also you play with the layer mask and then use a brush tool and make it finer and then you will add some glow here for this purpose you need to go to this layer and then click a brush tool here and then select the color little bit bluish okay and then simply paint here and then change this blending mode from normal to hard light or color dots and change the opacity I have already done it so I will left it look like this and that final you will play with the curve adjustment you can see the curves you go to this and then section you will find your curves and actually it looks like this and the curves look like this and you will make it like a S curve this is the highlight this is the shadow and this is the mid tone and simply then play with the opacity so let's do it like this okay so that's it guys that's just the final result and i know it is a very quick process you can repeat this video in order to uh, learn it and as i said you need to have some basic photoshop knowledge so let me begin it from the beginning so wait and wait so this is the original picture then you make a selection then you make a color correction then you add a background then you add a moon then you play with the color balance and then you add a photo filter and then make it look like a night then you add some light and some particles then glow and glow and curves and for Instagram I will always make a photo in 4 to 5 resolution this is vertical you can also make 1 to 1 square and if it is landscape or 4 to 5 and 5 to 7 is for TikTok so this is the final result I hope you guys uh, like this video and I will also make another Photoshop manipulation tutorial and if you have any question you can simply leave the comment and don't forget to subscribe my channel and stay tuned. Have a nice time. Bye bye. bye.